is bed. Tuesday. I just got back from the, I'm just got from the car from the salon. I got my nails done. This like purple silver color. So and it is Monday night. Um, I I got my nails done like I said earlier. And reading wise, I read more of Dragon Republic and my like forty percent. I listened to that when I was getting my nails done. Cause a bad bitch do everything together. I don't know the fuck what that was. I'm tired. And then I finished X Men Red. I need to take a picture of Instagram of me with the shirt I wore for the shirt to count. I also started New Mutants Volume 4. I also, okay, so we'll rewind that. X-Men Red, really loved it. Love Storm. Excited to talk about this at the wrap-up at the end of the month. Um, it's really loved her character growth, and I am really excited to continue on with this series because I love Storm and Magneto, and this series spotlights those two characters. Um... I then started New Mutants, because I need to read more comics, because I'm really behind on my uh, Goodreads challenge. But yeah, I will check with y'all later, tomorrow. Okay, so I just finished filming my vlog um, video for Friday. I think I was going to mass film, but I think I'm not going to, because April, I really don't need to. I probably will. F I might film two videos tomorrow, but I'm kind of, like, mentally drained from that. So, and I kind of want to read. So, I'm glad I did that. But this is the shirt I was talking about. So, this is the shirt that I did for um, the... Magical Readathon challenge of um, Art of Illusion. Read a shirt that matches a book that matches your outfit. And like, we got Storm here, we got Storm there. I think the Storm has this outfit at one point in here, like right here. Bam. So, like, I love the shirt and I love Storm. So, easy. Last night, I did a big Instagram post because I saw a post from, I think his name is at Greg's Library on Instagram. It was like a books. Instagram starter pack and I really liked the idea and I had fun on it and I've had a lot of fun making it on Canva so that I might make more um posts like that I think I'm gonna do an April wrap-up on Instagram after I upload the video on Friday because I think it's gonna be fun maybe I'll do like TBRs and wrap-ups on there after the videos are up just so I have more stuff to do on Instagram. It was really fun. I enjoyed it. It's also just a way for me to get my creativity out there, which is something I enjoy doing. Like, I like working on my reading journal for that. But um, today, I haven't really read much. I did get to page, like, halfway through of New Mutants, volume three, I want to say. Let me check. Pull my Kindle out. So, it is New Mutants, volume three, Vida Ayala's run. I'm really enjoying it. I love the, like story of magic magic's story magic with a k it's a character i am enjoying their story and how they are kind of like healing from their trauma from limbo and i'm also excited to see where madeline Pryor ends up at the end of this comic for the dark web event that takes place later well, that already happened but takes place after the story but i'm just catching up on new mutants i'm hoping to catch up on my reading i'm probably going to read a little bit of legends lessons of vengeance today we'll see and i kind of want to play overwatch but i do need to clean my room we'll see if that happens again my nose itches i say again like i said it before but i was trying not to scratch it but it itched but also i did see um i watched what movie today god get us got us help me um Dungeons and Dragons. I saw that today with my brother. I really enjoyed it. It was really fun. Um, I'm a minor D&D fan. My brother's a big, bigger D&D fan, but we saw it. He saw it. This is the second time seeing it. But we had a lot of fun watching it. It was really good. I thought the acting was fun. I like how they all were just having fun. And then, like, I don't know why, but April is, like, movie trailer mania. They released the trailer for Blue Beetle yesterday, which, like, that movie looks amazing. And then they released the trailer for Barbie today, which that movie looks amazing. And I believe they also released the trailer for Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Or Across the Spider-Verse, which I haven't seen the trailer. I need to watch the trailer after this. And I'm, I mean, I already know that movie looks amazing from the stuff I've seen. I'm very excited for these movies that are coming out this summer. I haven't felt this excited for a, like, summer of movies in a while. Like, summer movie releases in a while. And I'm just very excited because we have... Barbie, we have Blue Beetle, we have um, Into the Sp Across the Spider-Verse, we have uh, Little Mermaid, Guardians of the Galaxy, I'm also excited for, kind of The Flash, even though, like, uh, Ezra Miller can go fuck themselves, um, I said what I said, but yeah, I just haven't been this excited for a lot of movies in a while, 
like, of uh, summer releases. Like, I've been excited for, like, a movie or two, but I just haven't been excited for a lot of these movies that are coming out in a while, so I'm really happy for that. But, yeah, um, I will check in with you guys later. Um, I, it is Tuesday, like I said. Um, I don't work tomorrow, so we'll see what I do tomorrow. I don't have any plans, really. Um, maybe read. And then I go to work Thursday, Friday, Saturday, which, I mean, I'll take you with me, of course. And then Sunday, I, um, don't have any plans for Easter Sunday. Maybe I'll see a princess once help with sprints, unless we have family plans. But, um, what else do I have planned for this week? I don't know. I do hope to finish more books. I gotta put books away, um, which is why I don't want to film the haul right now. I don't want to grab all those books. Because setting up my fucking, um... Ring light has just been so irritating lately, and it's just because it's a pain to, like, make sure it's standing still and not falling apart, and so it's just a hassle to do. But, uh, I don't think I have any more plans. I might show you guys some of my reading journal I've been working on. We'll see that. We'll, I might just lay down and watch TV. I don't know. I don't have any more plans for tonight. But, yeah, I will see y'all later. Bye! So, hello. It is, um... Wednesday. I am right now currently putting on medicine for a face, my skin issue. So I thought I'd be a little productive in this vlog and use it and also use this as a camera to see as I rub this medicine into my face. But um, reading updates, I read, um, Finished the comic I was reading, so New Mutants Volume 3. I finished it. I really enjoyed it. I liked how it explored Magic's journey in letting Limbo go. And I also enjoyed how it talked on, um, even though she was clearly, like, supporting role, I like on how it paralleled it with Madeline Pryor and how Limbo is different for her than it is for Magic. And how for Limbo, it was a form of, um, the realm for magic was a form for um punishment it was a torture place for her but for um madeline Pryor, it could be something healing for her because it gets her away from like krakoa where sinister is and everything like that but i thought that was pretty interesting but um yeah um i listened to a little bit couple minutes of the dragon republic today i'm probably gonna try to listen to more i think i'm gonna be doing reading sprints on discord with princess i haven't um she hasn't gotten back to me yet but i want to try to read a little bit of lessons of vengeance i do work tomorrow and so i'll be reading more then and then um i got in the mail blood debts came in the mail came out yesterday so i'm really happy about that i'm really excited to get this one of my most anticipated books of the year um, but my reading goals is to have The Dragon Republic and Lessons of Vengeance done by Sunday. So I need to do the math to see how many pages I gotta read and hours I gotta listen to to get it done by Sunday. But that is my goal. But yeah, I will check in with y'all later. Right now. Everybody. She's just silently judging me on the bed. She's gonna get a bath. This is her before bath. Look how dirty she is. I'm gonna give her a bath in a minute. She's like, I bet. Now look at her clean. Cleaning herself, but clean. Right now. Well, I mean, she's not cleaning herself, but. Me right now. I was checking with you guys yesterday because of work. I go, I'm go. i about to go to work right now. It is about, like, 2.30. Um, I work today 3 to 11, and then I work tomorrow 12 to 8. Uh, but yesterday I didn't really physically read, but I did listen to my audiobook. I got to, like, 70% of The Burning God. Burning God. And I'm really enjoying it. It's getting good. I'm back part three of it. So I'm really excited. And then my book of the month came in. So I got... My book of the month pick was Anna Maria and the Fox. Which is a um, Regency romance, I think. And then I also got... Uh, bring down the Duke. I've been having like a stuffed nose forever. So I don't know if it's a stuffed nose. So I'm finally being affected by allergies. But it's a pain in the ass. So there's that. Um, I don't know because if, if I'm sick or if it is allergies because I've never really had allergies before. 
So I had like a sore throat and stuff and it was on and off the last couple weeks. And it's been irritating. <laughs> so I'm having his allergies. Um, but yeah. That's how I've been doing. <laughs> like I said, I didn't really touch any of Legends of Vengeance or my comic um, that I'm reading. So I started this comic, um, Supergirl Woman of Tomorrow. I don't think I said that yet. It is a Supergirl story that takes place in space. It They're going to make a movie about it. It's going to be one of the live action movies that James Gunn has planned for the DC EU now that he's in charge of that. So it's about time I read it. But yeah, I will check with you all later. Hello, so it's Saturday night. I didn't check with you guys last night. I checked with you yesterday morning, but not last night. But I finished um, the... Yesterday I read a little bit of... I got closer to the end of The Burning God. And I touched a little bit of Lessons of Vengeance. And then today I finished The Burning God at a work. And I started Midnight Strikes audiobook. And then I read a little bit more of Lessons of Vengeance. Lessons of Vengeance, I'm really on like page 90. I'm going to hopefully do a lot more during Princess of Sprints tomorrow. So that's my goal. But um, Burning God, 5 out of 5 stars. The Poppy War trilogy is amazing. Um, Arf Kong just doesn't miss. I've read all her books so far. I'm excited for Yellow Face when it comes out um, at the fall. But yeah, Arf Kong, Yellow Face, oh, she's like up there with the authors now on my list. But I will check with y'all later. I'm cleaning my room at the moment, but look at her. As she licks her paws, not giving any care to the world. So it is Sunday morning. It is about 11 o'clock almost. Um, I'm doing sprints with Princess. Show you guys the camera in the middle of the first sprint, which is a 50 minute sprint because uh, people like rolling big numbers. Thank you, Mike. Um, do I got I, my eyes are, I don't know. I am still fighting this stuff, ready dose and cough. Like, my sore throat's not gone pretty much, but like, for now. We'll see if it continues. Um, I am on the first sprint listening to Midnight Strikes, so I could jot it down in my writing um, journal that I listened to an audiobook today, and then I'm going to try to focus on, for the rest of the sprints, reading um, my physical book, um, Lessons of Vengeance. I ordered Starbucks, so I got that, because Princess had Starbucks, and it made me want Starbucks, so... We have that, and then I'm in the middle of the sprints. Us doing sprints. Yeah, we got like five minutes left. Yeah. These are cute. They got me a little biscuit for Easter. Love yeah, them. This is me closing out the vlog. It's technically Tuesday. I meant to close this out Sunday night, but didn't do that. I meant to close this out yesterday, but didn't do that. So I'm closing it out today. Um, so this vlog was somewhat successful. I did finish three books. I finished X Men Red Volume One, which I gave five stars. I finished. New Mutants, um, Volume 3, which I gave th four stars, and then I finished, um, uh, Burning, The Burning God, which I gave another five stars, so I enjoyed both those books, Al Ewing is a really good writer, comic book writer, I love his take of Storm and Magneto, and, um, I'm excited to continue on with that series and see how they control what happens with Araco. The New Mutants one was really good. I enjoyed um, Magic's storyline and her healing process, which basically this book was. And then for The Burning God, like, Arf Kong doesn't know how to miss. I'm glad I've read every Arf Kong book there is out available right now. And she has now become one of my autobi authors. I'm really excited for Yellow Face to come later this year. But um, I enjoyed this. I'm glad you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment down below anything, I guess. Um, I post videos every Wednesday and Friday. Wednesdays are vlogs, Fridays are regular videos. Um, links down below will be for my other, where you can find me other places, and my Discord, where we'd have the book club, my book club, Enchanted Forest Book Club, and the Throne of Glass readathon takes place on the Discord. Um, I will see y'all later.